Greetings and welcome back everybody to a new video. So today I have something different to review. This is the Xiaomi Smart Bedside Lamp 2. But first, roll the intro. Hey Google, turn the bedside lamp on. Hey Google, change the color of the bedside lamp to green. Sure, changing bedside lamp to green. So before we begin, if you are new to my channel and if you like the content that I create, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and do hit that bell icon so that you can get notifications for my latest uploads. And also do follow me on Instagram and on Facebook, all the links are in the video description. Alright so let me just unbox this thing and I will get back to you guys. Alright so I've got the Xiaomi Smart Bedside Lamp 2 unboxed and you can see it comes with a power adapter, manual and the lamp itself. And that is pretty much all you get inside the box. So basically this is a table lamp with an RGBW LED that can show up to 16 million colors. And this one also connects to the internet so you can control the lamp from your phone. And I think this will be a really nice addition to my already existing RGB setup over here. Got lots of RGB LEDs in the computer and I think this one will complement the setup quite nicely. So this is the power adapter that comes with the lamp. This one has an output voltage of 12 volts at 1 amp. And this lamp is rated at 12 volts and it will output about 400 lumens of light at maximum intensity. And this is the connector of the adapter. All right, so I have connected the adapter. Let us turn the lamp on. So these are your touch sensitive controls. Just tap on the power button gently and the lamp will turn on. And right now it is running at maximum intensity and let me tell you, it is actually quite bright. Now again, I told you this is a touch sensitive control panel so you can just adjust the intensity like this. And I like how the, these buttons are backlit. That is a really nice touch. So you can also touch like this to adjust the intensity. So right now it is running in this warm white mode. You just press this refresh button once and that changes the color tone of the LED. So this is cool daylight and that is warm white. So that is actually quite yellow. And this is sort of neutral white. And that goes back to the uh, cool daylight. Now if you press and hold this button, the lamp will enter into this RGB mode. Again, just tap on it once to change the color. So there are two distinct modes. One mode is where you can change the colors. It cycles through RGB. And if you press and hold, it will enter into this uh, cool daylight and warm white mode. So this is cool daylight, warm white, and neutral white. So let us turn the intensity of the light down a little bit. And let us check out the lamp itself. It's quite a nice design. Very, very minimalistic. No designs on the lamp. And this is plastic by the way, this is not glass. Let's take a look at the bottom and there is a QR code over there for your Apple Home app. And the rated power is 8 watts and you have nice thick rubber pads so that the lamp won't slip. So you guys already know that this is a smart lamp. That means you can have full control over the lamp from your smartphone. And yes, it also works with Google Assistant Alexa and Apple HomeKit. But before that, you will need to connect the lamp to your home Wi-Fi network. So now let me show you how you can connect the lamp to your home Wi-Fi network. So grab your phone and go to Play Store and download and install the Xiaomi Home app. Now I already use Xiaomi products, so I already have the Xiaomi app installed on my phone. And you will need to make a Xiaomi account so I have already done that. And once you finish setting up the Xiaomi Home app, you will see this screen. Now tap on the plus button over here, then tap on lighting and select Me Bedside Lamp 2. 
Okay, so the app is asking me to simultaneously press and hold the power button and the mode button for 5 seconds until the lamp starts circulating through the colors red, green and blue. Okay, so what we need to do is press and hold these two buttons until the lamp resets itself. That's it. Now we are going to tap operation confirmed and then press next. So after about 10 seconds, you should see this screen. It is already showing me the Wi-Fi network the lamp wants to connect. So press on next. And that is it. Now the bedside lamp has been added. Uh, let's name it as bedroom, bedside lamp, next. And let's get started. Agree. Okay, so once you have finished setting up, you will see the bedside lamp over here in the devices menu. And you can turn it on and off from over here and you don't even need to be connected to the Wi-Fi network so turn off Bluetooth and Wi-Fi this thing can work across mobile data as long as your phone and the bedside table lamp has internet connection that means you will need to leave Wi-Fi turned on at your home so I can still turn it on and off even though my phone is not connected to Wi-Fi so no matter where I am in the world I can actually still turn the bedside lamp on and off all right, so first off, I'm going to show you the functionality of the Xiaomi Home app. And then later on, I will show you how to make this lamp work with Google Assistant. So when you launch the Xiaomi Home app, you will see this screen. Just tap on the bedside lamp and it will take you to this window. Now you have four options at the bottom. This is your power button. You can turn the lamp on and off. You can also turn the lamp on and off by pressing this power button over here. So this one also does the exact same thing. So I have turned the lights off so you can get an idea of how the colors and the brightness is like. So right now it is running at minimum brightness. So the brightness is set to the lowest level and it's actually still quite bright. If I increase the brightness, it does become extremely bright. And it's brighter than how it's appearing on the camera, by the way. If I drop the brightness down, I think it'll be a little bit more clear on the camera. So the way you change brightness is by swiping your finger vertically. Brightness goes up if you swipe up and if you swipe down like this, the brightness will also go down. If you swipe your finger horizontally, that actually changes the color temperature. So that is cool daylight, 6000 Kelvin. And if I keep swiping like this, that is warm white. So that's actually quite yellow. So this is the white mode. If you want to get into RGB mode, tap on color and the lamp is now in RGB mode. Same thing, swipe up and down to change the brightness. And if you swipe horizontally, it changes the color. That is quite deep pink. So that is how you can change the colors. Now colors may not be 100% accurate on the camera, but in real life, it does look quite fantastic. I really like the blue color. This aqua blue looks superb. And this is running at 54% brightness. I think that is quite comfortable right now. The fourth option here is flow. If you tap on this, it will cycle through different colors. Again, swiping up and down changes the brightness and swiping horizontally changes the speed at which the colors change. So that will slow down the color change process and that will speed up the color change process. You can see it taking effect on the lamp. And if you tap on flow settings, over here you can pick your colors. If you wanna change, just do this, apply. And now we have a slightly different set of colors that the lamp will cycle through. Swipe like this and over here you have favorites. So these are some predefined uh, presets that are already installed. There is sunrise, simulates sunrise. So the light will gradually get brighter in 15 minutes. Then we have sunset, simulate sunset. The light will gradually dim in 10 minutes and then turn off. So the next mode is actually quite interesting. It's called night light. If you turn this on, the lamp will go to the minimum intensity possible. And that is even dimmer than what you can set the lamp manually over here. 
and just to give you guys an idea that's how bright the lamp is when it's running in night mode actually that's not bright at all it's very comfortable if i turn off all the other lights i think this will be sufficient as a night lamp moving on we have birthday so this is kind of mood lighting thingy and then date night cozy home yeah that is bright but that is sort of in between warm white and neutral white then we have romantic evening and then finally candle flicker it kind of changes intensity to simulate a candle flickering but it's quite far off from what a candle flicker looks like so the final mode is flash notification but unfortunately i could not get this to work so even when this is turned on, if I send myself a text message or call myself, the intensity of the light actually does not change. So let me just switch it over to warm white. And then if I go to favorites, turn on flash notifications, you guys will see actually nothing will happen if I send myself a text message. So here we go. See the light does not actually change intensity even though I have applied this one again I'll try it again put my phone to sleep send myself a text message yeah I know it does not work but anyways does not matter because all of the other features are working now if you tap on these three dots that will open up this menu and over here you can set a power off timer let's go back this card changes and you can also set a schedule if you want the light turn on and off at a particular schedule then you have automatic night light you can set the timer over here when it should turn on and off automatically and i think that is pretty much it for the xiaomi home app you can also update the firmware of the lamp it is up to date so don't need to change that so now let me show you how you can configure the lamp to work with google assistant first off launch google assistant let's go to settings and we will go to assistant then scroll down here and then tap add a device and then link a device and we will search for xiaomi home so actually it's called mi home we will need to search for this and then tap over here and it will ask you to sign in with your xiaomi account let me just do that and i'll be right back okay so that is pretty much all you need to do and now it should show up in this home control tab so over here you can see all these different devices that it picked up automatically from the Xiaomi home application. So now we can control the lamp from the Google Assistant app. Turn off bedside lamp. Sure, turning off bedside lamp. And that is it. Turn bedside lamp on. Lamp. Change the color of the bedside lamp to green. Okay, changing bedside lamp to green. Increase the brightness of the bedside lamp to 100%. Okay, setting bedside lamp brightness to 100%. So that is it, that's how the assistant integration works with the Xiaomi bedside lamp. I think this is pretty awesome, you can just control the bedside lamp from anywhere in the world just by using your voice. So guys that is pretty much all there is to it for the Xiaomi smart bedside lamp 2. Unfortunately I cannot show you the Alexa integration or the Apple HomeKit integration because I don't have either one of those devices but yeah I do love this lamp love the rgb colors and i do like the google assistant integration and if you have any questions do feel free to ask me in the comment section down below and i'll be more than happy to answer you guys turn off bedside lamp sure turning bedside lamp off so thank you guys for watching stay tuned for more videos like these and i will see you guys next time